I think what makes a project successful isn't necessarily the technology or even the design skills of the people who are creating it, but it's a, a clarity around the real business purpose. And it may sound obvious, but I think all too often it gets lost as we focus very much on the content and, and the technology and the design approach. Uh, we, we lose what we're really trying to achieve, which is to make some sort of improvement or change in behavior. So it might be that uh, it's in, to enable people to perform better or it's to enable them to deal with customer inquiries or new products or it could, there are a whole range of potential business needs. And so really understanding that is one key thing. And the other one, which I think is often missed out, is then really understanding who we're, who we're creating this e-learning for. I think the difference between classroom training, of course, and the design and development of e-learning is that in a classroom, you've got the people in front of you. You can see how they're responding. You can tailor things to, the, to their needs. Um, when you're creating e-learning content, that's not the case. And it's easy to ignore the end user.